Hey everyone, Tragic here, and yes, this is the last of the Lottery Masterpiece hunts. Down to the end of these boxes, we have got actually three packs left in each box. So we're going to open up all three, each one of these, right now. Been doing this now for about two years. It's kind of off and on. I started off doing one pack um, per video. And that wasn't going fast enough, so I ended up switching to two. So I think in the end, this is the 19th video that I'm doing in this series. And I am going to just go out with the last of these and see how we do with these packs. All right, let's put them in some kind of order like that. <laughs> and then, of course, we will scan up. Uh, any rares that we find and hopefully for the last time one masterpiece maybe one masterpiece left in here uh, out of these six boxes I managed to pull two masterpieces so that's, that's pretty decent I, uh, I think and sure enough I have learned my tragic lesson let's do it here kind of just kind of skate through the commons and look at the uncommons and try not to spoil if there is anything big coming up sifter worm Crypt of the Eternals, Saving Grace, Amid Eternal, a card I kind of like actually, and it's a whole 50 cents, there we go, so this has been uh, a lot of fun, I don't think I'm going to go ahead and get another six boxes just to keep doing it on and on, this is just going to be the end of it, alright, what did I say, I was going to go quick, Rampaging Hippo was in there, got a Hash Up Oasis, 8th place Dave's favorite card. Bloodwater Entity, Ominous Sphinx, and Hour of Revelation. Let's see if any of these rares are any good. Not particularly. All right. Um, did I? Yep, that's right. I really threw myself off. I was in my brain expecting two, even though I just said. And I literally pulled out three packs of each set. So three packs of Hour of Devastation. Touch of Venom, a Ruin Rat. We got Nissa's Defeat, a Braid. That's a good card. We'll go ahead and scan it, although it's been uh, reprinted, so it's not as worth as much. Saving Grace and Pride Sovereign is a couple bucks. All right. That was it. Our Devastation. Moving on to Amiket. Been a lot of fun. I did get a Misty Rainforest. I believe it was a Steel Overseer, the other one. So, would be really nice to get just one more. Cryptic Serpent, Oketra's Monument, and Destined to Lead, and Rags to Riches. Bing, ba bing. It actually saw a couple different versions. We'll take off the one that it was not. And an Initiate. Ancient Crab, Priests, Dissenters, some Cats, fun stuff, Devoted Crop Mate, Zenith Seeker, Limits of Solidarity, Heaven and Earth is 40 cents, and nothing, alright, get another one here, alright, Sacred Cat, a Kudu, a Vitalist, Start to Finish by Force, Exemplar of Strength, Cruel Reality, got a Mythic, it's an Aura Curse at the beginning of Enchanted Player's Upkeep, that player sacrifices a creature, or Planeswalker, if the player can't hear, she loses its 5 life. That would be pretty powerful as a global effect for everybody in Commander, but I think... As a single target card, it's not that big. Yeah, 488. It's not nothing. And a punch card. All right, on to Oath of the Gate Watch. Scythe Master. Got some Eldrazi's in here. Hedron Crawler. Contortion. Stoneforge Acolyte. Press into service. Got a foil at least of something. Ooh, we got Inverter of Truth, 
Not the mythic you want here. It's a 6 6 with Devoid for only 4. It's got flying. When it enters the battlefield, exile all cards from your library face down. Then shuffle all cards from your graveyard into your library. So you don't want to use that too early on. We got a uh, foil Stone Forge Masterwork. Is a couple 250 um, regular version. The foil version's four bucks. So nice pack right there. Nothing extra in it. Okay. Oath it up. The Flame Seeker. Negate. Lantern. I got a Meandering River. Unity of Purpose. Weapons Trainer. Crush of Tentacles. Two Mythics in a row. Four and two blue with a Surge cost. Return all non land permanents to their owner's hand. If Crush of Tentacles Surge cost is paid, put an 8 8 blue octopus creature token onto the battlefield. Good with the octopuses. It's a buck. 74. And a full art forest. All right. Thanks for watching. As always, make sure to smash that like button. And comment down below. Have you enjoyed watching me search for lottery cards? There's a waste. It is 81 cents. It's okay. Got a Strider Harness. Storm Chaser Mage. Tears of Valakut. Nissa, Voice of Zendikar. So doing pretty good. On the Mythics out of Oath of the Gate Watch. That's great. Um, 587 promo pack. And four bucks for Nissa. Cool Planeswalker. She does some stuff with some plants and gaining life and putting counters on stuff. There we go. And a Scion. Uh, let's see. Battle for Zendikar. Three packs. Um, wow, that pack got mangled. Okay. And I've already pulled a Misty Rainforest out of this box, so probably not going to get anything too exciting. You never know, right? You never know. Got a Spell Shrivel, Rot Shambler, Slab Hammer, Blighted Cataract, and Planar Outburst. Destroy some creatures and an ally. <laughs> Packs are weird. Stalwart. Drone, drone. Sky spawner. Vile aggregate. Blood bond vampire retreat to Amiria and Akum firebird. Raking in the mythics. Um, flying haste. It attacks each turn of fable. It's got landfall whenever land enters the battlefield under control. You may pay a bunch. If you do, return it from your graveyard to the battlefield. 56 cents. All right. <clears throat> Sludge Crawler. Rush of Ice. Oops, got a foil coming up. We got Core Entanglers. Halamar Tide Collar. Infused with the Elements. Ghoul Draws Overseer. And a Giant Mantis. Which is a uh, pretty nice little common there. A scion, and that's it. All right. Eighth Revolt. So I believe this is where I got the Steel Overseer. So this, these packs probably don't have any bonus in them. But we got to get through them. Prey Upon. Poisoner. Trophy Mage. Death Dismissal. Efficient Construction. Herald of Anguish. It's going to Mythic Town today. 5 and 2 black. It's a 5-5 five, five demon with Improvise. And flying at the beginning of your end step, each opponent discards a card. You pay 1 and a black. Sacrifice an artifact. Target creature gets minus 2, minus 2 until end of turn. I think this one might be halfway decent. Well, it's halfway decent. It's a couple bucks. All right. I must be thinking of a different demon from this era. Demon of Dark Schemes, maybe, is what I was thinking of. Chaser. Conviction, Crusher, Daredevil Dragster, World Fast Engineer, Hungry Flames, Call for Unity with Revolt. 
Oops. And we've got a Ragavan uh, token, which um, <clears throat> I don't know if the token's worth a whole lot. Eh, it's worth a little bit. It's a buck. I figured I would scan it. Eagle. Salvager. Implement. Gremlin Infestation. Illusionist's Stratagem. Airdrop Aeronauts. Spire of Industry. Is not much reprinted in Kamigawa Commander and Energy Token. All right, this is the last hurrah right here. Three packs of Kaladesh. What are we gonna get? Got some grubs, a giant spectacle, indeed. Oops, I'm spoiling the foil of whatever that was. Servo Exhibition, Sequestered Stash. Confiscation coup. Was that only two uncommons? Okay. Confiscation coup. 35 cents. And a cowl prowler. And an emblem. So did I not get three uncommons in that pack? Did I miss them in? Oh, there it was. The cloud blazer. All right. Everything's right in the world. We got a Chandra emblem. We'll scan that too. It's a little bit. I'll hang on to it. Fire Weaver. Live fast. Ballista Charger. Furious Reprisal. Janjeet Sentry. Panharmonicon. That's pretty decent. Yep, doubling up some triggered abilities. Something that people like to do. It's nine bucks. Servo token. All right. Last pack of our search for masterpieces. Let's do it one more time. Come on now. We've got an Ibex. The Cathartic Reunion. Appetite for the Unnatural. I'm just going to say all the names. No, I'm not. Shrewd Negotiation. Oval Chase Daredevil, Minister of Inquiries, Deadlock Trap is our last rare here. It's nothing much. And a servo. So that was that. A nice little stack here. Thanks for coming along, everybody who watched uh, a lot of these videos. Uh, it was fun to do. Um, and it made content. That was the whole thing. So anyway, Tragic MTG. Thanks for watching, as always. I'll catch you on the next one.